This tutorial is how to create a new username in WordPress. Uh, this tutorial really is not that hard, but considering uh, it's probably one of the things that I actually do get questions from newbies, it's probably better to have this. So, uh, in your WordPress backend, you go to Users, Add New, And uh, what it comes up is a little form, and you just fill it out and put in your uh, user. And you need you do need an email. Uh, name. Um, website's optional, and then uh, like a password. And um, uh, you can uh, choose to whenever you click to add the you the button for the user. You can uh, send this info to the new user um, by default. It's already checked, and then uh, remember to set the role um, by default. Um, usually, by your settings, if you haven't adjusted this, usually it's set by default to subscriber. Maybe you might have like a newsletter or some type of subscription plugin for your WordPress backend. Um, but otherwise, if they're like an author, or contributor. Um, or if some uh, you want to give them some control over your website, then you can just put like administrator. So all you got to do is add uh, the user. There you go. Now, as you can see, um, if you you create a user, you may not have an icon here. Uh, it might be um, like gray with like it's called the mystery man and. Uh, the reason why this looks different is because it's using Gravatar, which is a globally, globally recognized avatar. And I really recommend that because uh, a lot of uh, WordPress blogs are enabled for Gravatar. And it shows up in your comments, this little cool avatar. And all you have to do is use your email address to sign up. And, uh, and basically, uh, your back end, uh, your WordPress, or like in comments, Will, this will come up. So anyway, that's how you create a new user. Uh, thank you.